This is a really useful nade set that I think is underutilized on Ancient. And the reason that it's so useful is because it can be thrown by a single player and you can build a ton of different strategies around it. So I'm going to show the smoke here that you will want to build everything around. And all that is, is you come into this corner and aim between, between the leaves here and you just left click throw. And what that's going to do is it's going to smoke out a lot of these angles on the B site by smoking the center. So now if anybody is towards long, they can't see towards long and they have to jump up and actually jump and spot if they want to see it. And then this side of the pillar is also completely blocked. So now the only angles that you have in order to see anybody who's coming up towards the B site is going to be through cave here. With that smoke down, it's very easy to include another grenade on that, which is just a basic pillar Molotov, just like this. And now you're eliminating essentially every single angle towards the site and towards cave where the enemy team can actually see down. The only angle that they can have at this point is when this Molotov is down, they can sit behind it a little bit further here, but obviously they're going to be exposed to Cheetah when they do this. Another benefit of these grenades is that they're really good at splitting up the B site players. So if the enemy team is running some sort of default where they're going heavy middle and they only have two players starting at B, you can really easily isolate the cave player from the B site player. And the reason that that happens is because when the smoke is down, the site player is going to be concerned about some sort of play involved with that smoke where somebody's coming up the ramp and maybe trying to fight site. So he's going to be looking around this area, trying to protect the bomb site, and the cave player is going to be concerned about cave at this point. And when this molly lands, they have to make the decision, do they want to continue to fight cave by themselves or do they want to back out and fall back with their teammate? And obviously if they back out, you get cave for free as a T as long as you take it. If they stay in here, if you send a few people cave, you can very easily trade that player and get cave control. And now you're in a four on four with cave control or something similar to that. Another way that you can use this nade set is to easily isolate a player who's playing close on the B site. So let's say that T's or sorry, the CTs have some sort of setup where they frequently play somebody close towards banana who's getting flashed from a teammate behind him to peek this over and over, which people pretty frequently do. So what you can do that would easily counter that is you can throw this same smoke and then you can throw the pillar Molotov. And I would recommend having a second player throwing this pillar Molotov and they're going to be the one that's going into the site. So after throwing this nade set, you wait a couple seconds, so three or four seconds, and then the player back here can molly cubby. And then after that, they can flash up the ramp for their teammate. And basically their teammate can run up the ramp with that flash, turn, come in and fight anybody who's close here. And the benefit of that is because you're mollying pillar and smoking out the center of the site here, if anybody is playing close, they're going to have to commit through this Molotov and they're going to be somewhere inside of this area here on the bomb site. So they're committing to Cubby or they're going to be close against this wall. And by throwing that Cubby Molotov a few seconds after, they're going to start burning if they're in Cubby. And if they want to fall out at this point, they have to run through two Molotovs or they have to fully commit. And that will be when the flash comes in and when your teammate is coming up ramp, peeking them and fighting. And that should hopefully give you an easy entry on the B bomb site. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this video useful. This is a new video idea that I'm going to be doing for the channel. I'm relatively new to this, so if there's anything you see that I could improve or make better, just let me know. But otherwise, thank you for watching, and I will see you next video.